now he has water here. So let's wait for that moment. This one uses water. It uses water. That mine is. Let's go. concentration we have low oxygen concentration yeah how are hey you guys, mr what's up it's maro here uh, we are it's gintu yeah gintu with other boys who are fixing the clay bath yeah it's very hot so it's time for us to actually enjoy this clay bath uh, when are you gonna enjoy here man uh, maybe by tomorrow i'll be here <laughs> <laughs> because it's too hot yeah sure it's too hot, it's too hot. Yes. so guys uh you have heard from him one-on-one -on -one life that's why we are taking the responsibility of maintenance yes. practices and to this area so tomorrow we're gonna be seeing him live live one-on-one -on -one live yes. with ayamara here i'll bring inside Rocio also oh bring Rocio. Yes. i will also bring her okay because since we had this clay but we've not actually enjoyed it Wagwan. other people enjoy yeah, yeah by the yeah. way that's why i asked such a question such a yeah. question because uh, I've never seen you here, we'll even come. washing. We'll come. And uh, I've felt that water is very, very fantastic. Yes. It's not so cold, it's somewhere warm, warm because of the sun. Yeah? I want to show you something like yeah. the color of water uh -huh. is the ground and the sky. Oh, you see that water? Okay, it's not that, it's not that, it is the ground and the sky. Okay, yeah? because. Look at the difference between this water over there uh -huh. and this here. That you want to drink that water because it looks yeah, clean. Yeah, more clean, yeah. But it's because the ground is clear. Okay. And the other side looks very dirty, but the water is just flowing over there. You see, from here to there, it looks very, very clean. Very clean, yeah. Yes. But where it has uh, congested a little bit, you can see it's very, it's dirty somehow. It's not dirty. It's the ground. Yeah, the ground. The ground, then the sky adds up the... Yeah. The reflection like now. That up, up there is very clear. Yeah, sure. So you see, there is very clear. Okay. The other side, because of sun, uh -huh. you see like it's kind of dirty because sun gives the vibe of uh, like soil and that. Okay. Yeah, it's like stones. That's why you see it's very clear. Uh, do you have plans of this area one day, maybe? Yeah, actually, uh, my plan may be in the future. If I buy that small piece of land, that I'll one. put a wall there okay. and then make this area very fantastic that uh, people can come and sit and drink and cook here in the river. Okay. But we need to fence it because we want somebody like you can be here up to midnight okay. and you still feel safe. Yeah, safety first, yes. safety precautions. Yes, and also this clay bath in future, people should be paying to use it actually, yeah, sure. like 20 US. Okay. Because you spend a lot of money creating it. Uh, yes. the, the, the wires, the gabions, yeah. talk you, about the gabions. People, people yeah. just Yeah, even in. people. Yes. Also, we can talk about uh, hardcore there. Yes. The, 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 yeah. These are like uh, four tippers. Four tippers, yeah. yeah. And also the manpower that was used, yeah. it was and wages. Up to this point. Yeah, even this area, guys. Yeah. So, so everything is possible. Yes, very well. So, but you see, we can't really make it a nice place if it's open like this. Yeah, by yeah. Way. So that is the plan. Thank you very much, Marwa, right. for your time and to my channel. Okay. I'm going to be hosting you. Maybe tomorrow we shall meet here. Again. Yeah, again and again and again. Thank you very much. So, guys, it's a fantastic time we're meeting and making the cherishment together and a chit chat. This is going to be a very fantastic time ever. So, I have another guy here who is a chinku or a Chinese. Yeah. Hey, hi. What's up, guys? Welcome to It's, it's Understood It. Yeah, sure. So, this oh. is Mogesi Live. Yeah. Have you ever Beautiful people, welcome back. It's underscore Gintu. Today I'm taking responsibility of uh, making this clay butter clean as possible because Amara wants to bet here before he leaves the compound, guys. So I'm taking this responsibility with an immediate effect because uh, it's an urgent issue. So guys, uh, I'm here today. I'm taking responsibility of Mawera because he's not around. We take over the responsibility whenever whoever is around and they're going to be uh, broadcasting one-on-one -on -one live from the clay butter today, guys. Uh, so uh, this area, whenever the rain comes here, we have a flood onto this river YouTube. So whenever we have uh, some flood here, the, uh, some of sand is being heaped here because of the flood and everything. So it's very, very dirty. So that's why we wanted to make it as a very, very clean pathway as possible. So guys, uh, these are the stuff we are getting out from this heavy clay bag, guys.
guys that this is how things are moving into this area and this area should be very very neat today because we have a waterfall here which is responsible for people can be showering into this area whenever you see you can come and get yourself into this area you can get a you can shower here guys it's like a fall and whenever you now finish the playback and to this side you get uh, onto the water which is uh, running here throughout uh, the fall and you can get a uh, more vibe of feeling uh, this uh, warmth of uh, water guys uh, it's a, a very pleasure to give you one-on-one -on -one live from the clayback today i'm taking the responsibility one-on-one -on -one because uh, i am always about to get uh, him here bathing live but we have other visitors aligned get tuned so as you can now see whatever is taking place from this side it's underscore game to welcome back Hello, beautiful people today is one-on-one -on -one live coverage from on top of the villa Menjin. and today here we have uh, uh, one of the polishing day of the terrazzo on top grinding. of the villa Mary. this is now polishing yeah grinding oh the grinding day how are you bro I see now we have machines already packed. Yeah. So this is the big machine. Yeah, this so is the big machine for floor. For floor. For floor. For the grinding and everything. We use this one. Okay. Yeah. For the grinding, we yeah. use that one. The black area. Okay. We use this one. Or the black this one. Is for white area. Or for the white area. Yeah. The big machine. Yeah, big machine. And we have a big generator here, which is very hired today, so as it can do this kind of a job because it look at how big it is, because I was never there, even. Our small machine, we have a generator which is small and it will not even drive that small a grinding machine. But uh, today they have decided to bring this big one here and everything is very compatible here guys on top of this Villa Menjin and everything is coming to you live coverage from the Villa because uh, let's work. So uh, it's a connection here. We have uh, the grinder for the polishing of uh, uh, we, we, how is this side called now? The Scutting area. area. That one, the small one, the grinder. the grinder. This is the grinder, guys. Disc. Yeah, it has a grinding disc. This one here, this one, guys. So, this for the big, big, big area, which is the white area. Look at the the hedge. We have uh, our helipad hedge. Now the the area is now dry a little. So this is how the area looks like today. So we're gonna be showing you more of the relevant things coming out one on one. So. Here is the interconnection of cabling. It has two. Oh, so this is two face. Yeah. Yeah. Look at this, guys. It has this area and even that area. So the bigger areas for the bigger machine. Yeah. Okay. You have to fuel it. You have to fuel it. Live. It uses petrol. Yeah. It's a petrol driven, guys. It's a petrol driven. So here is the petrol. Huh? So where are you gonna starting, bro? From? Uh, we are going to start with where it is. Or where it is mm -hmm. for the sampling first? Yeah. yeah, sure. We have to refuel first the generator and everything to take uh, its own shape now. Live, or live. Live, live from live. Vira Medellin. Uh, Vira Medellin. Yeah. Hey, hey. Let's wait for that moment. Guys, uh, it's a fantastic moment today. I'm, uh, I'm representing Ebole, Ebole. The, the In Concept Interior Studio. Today I'm representing him because uh, he's not yet available a little and I'm going to be taking all the responsibility of him because even the day we started uh, uh, removing the screed uh, he was to be here but he told me i take over the responsibility so am i going to take the responsibility today yeah of course you can take it <laughs> <laughs> so guys uh, every... you can take it but not tomorrow not tomorrow, <laughs> not tomorrow. tomorrow you'll be around eh? uh, tomorrow I'll <laughs> i will be representing him okay tomorrow, today today i'm taking responsibility guys so i have it's like uh, it was a little bit of a joke because i want uh, to see even me i want to know how things are working and everything is moving at this area and this is a live coverage guys from the top of the villa menjin and today is the grinding day i was talking about what about when we talk about uh polishing day polishing day is after this after we grind after grinding uh, so now polishing we, we polish. so, so polishing is a uh, use of a uh, detergent of, um, kind of um, soaps yeah. 
HCL. HCL. Hydrochloric acid. Hydrochloric acid. So, hey, hey, that day I will never be available. <laughs> Guys, uh, that's a very toxic substance. No. I don't know if I will be available here. Yeah. Uh, uh, and how are you, are you going to be wearing now? I'll be wearing for oh, that time uh, to see. I'm a, I'm a professional of it. Okay. Uh, I don't fear it. Don't fear hydrochloric. Normally. Okay. Uh, so that it, it, it comes clean. You told me you have a YouTube channel, bro. I have a YouTube channel. Can you introduce yourself a little bit? I'm um, John, John Matarazzo, at Interior yeah. Designs. At interior Designs. Uh, from Kasaran. Kasaran, Nairobi. I work in Nairobi here. Okay. Yeah. I'm here to Marwasi Villa Minijin. Yeah. Doing terrazzo. Yeah, sure. I, uh, I also do tiles. Tiles. And cab rolls. Cab rolls. Uh, all of those. Guys, uh, today is one on one live. Live. Hey, today With is Joma Terrazzo and in the interior designs. So, from uh, interior, uh, in concept interior design, we have now the interior designers. Designers. Now the engineers. The engineers. Hey, of yeah. in it. One on one. <laughs> Live. So, <laughs> have you have we fueled? I've done with the fueling. Okay. No. Now we kick off. The kicking off. Okay, okay, okay. Let's wait for that moment, guys. We are waiting for that. Are you anxious of waiting for this part? It's coming to you live. Let's wait for that moment. Oh, he has uh, some uh, stuffs here. Uh, we, oh. have some, we have some hands oh, that we put like it a, okay. here. Okay, it now it comes and comes. This is the pulley, uh -huh. uh, which is the in injection with this. Okay. To oh, it has the grinders uh, now. Yeah. This, this is the this diamond. Is diamonds. Diamond. To uh, grind this area. They are very expensive. They are very expensive. Yeah. Expensive. Yeah. Okay. Very let, let, let me check. A pair has three. Wow. Set wow. and it is, is a set. Okay, this is a set. All oh, three. Oh, three. Okay, yeah. diamond. Yeah. Diamond. Okay, yeah. let's see that this moment. Where you put them. you put them? Okay. Here. Uh -huh. That way. Mm. That's that the fixing way. of them. Mm. That one there. Mm. Yeah, three. Very carefully. Okay. Yes. Now that one to be placed so as it can come and uh, attach it safely. land here. Okay. Uh, let's yeah. wait for that moment, guys. Look at this. This is the mandigan because it uses water. Huh? Oh, it this has? is a mud guard. Oh, to so prevent the, to prevent the, the mud. mud. From so that is not as great. Okay, okay, sure, sure. And 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 uh, you you place the water? Yeah. No, we put it in water. on the floor. Okay. So okay. Let's wait for that moment. Let's wait for that moment, guys. This is a motor. That's yeah. It has a motor. This motor is used to 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 run the pulley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You can see. Inside, yeah, yeah. I can see inside yeah. here. There's yeah. some. Uh, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah. It is high voltage. High voltage. Yeah, That's why they, you yeah, you have to use the bigger machine. Yeah, yeah. This is a three phase machine. A three phase motor. motor. Okay. Uh, Only electricity or big big generators uh, can run this stuff. Uh, all this is, is the normal grinder. Normal grinder. But the grinding disc is different from the other. This is okay. a diamond. Diamond. This is still a diamond. Like a diamond. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, but uh, they go that way, and uh, sometimes they go. Uh, they can come in. Okay, yeah, yeah. okay, they, they, they yeah. scrub until they, the they are over. Yeah. Okay, the they are okay, okay, okay. So they are very expensive, I know that. Mm -hmm. I yeah, whenever you place expensive. them that way, so yeah. it grinds. Yeah. That's why this one is for low the 5k. 5,000. 5, 5, the disc. Yeah. The disc. So this, this is 16,000. 16,000. The disc. Yeah, three yeah, discs. Yeah, the, the, the set of the diamond. Just three discs. Imagine, guys, we have now uh, seen them here. So today we're going to be having more of the relevant responsibility of uh, taking the uh, position of uh, now grinding this pit. So you told me this is called a. <laughs> this is a. Autorotating. Mad. Autorotating. As this for splashing of oh, the mud. So as a. So as. The all this, uh, the staffs yeah. cannot even hit yeah. your eyes and everything like that. And that even those in diamond can come and move out. Oh, so sure, sure. The diamond, ah, yeah, sure. They can hit you like a Cherokee drum. Yeah, yeah. Of course, yeah. So, guys, let's wait for that moment. I can see now it has water here. So, let's wait for that moment. This one uses water. It uses water. That mine is dusty. Dusty. Very dusty. Okay. okay. Are you using so much water here?
Ya waka is done. It's cutting timbers. Yeah. ears have to feel the vibe hey, our eardrums have to feel the vibe what's the the, the causative agent uh, i see like uh, there's something wrong a little bit uh, we, are, we, we are testing the machine the machines are now uh, tested uh, uh, everything no, so you can now see guys are uh, here
beautiful people welcome back it's underscore game to and today i'm giving this uh, broadcast one-on-one -on -one from uh, jova hotel again i've come to see the in condition or circumstances they are passing through so as we can make uh, this stuff once and for all because we have a fish pond here which is uh this is the biggest fish pond around this area and they're gonna be hosting a lot of fish into this area but uh, due to unconditional circumstances they want to whenever they want to open the hotel it has to be so clean as possible but uh, today they have soaked here in a little pond here whereby they have stocked a little uh, fish where you can now see them exposed direct to the sunlight which is a, a limiting factor of oxygen and to oxygen level and to this uh, fish pond already and also we can talk about uh, we have a, a little of a miscellaneous effect whereby there are now many exposed to the light you can now see how they are so many so they have grown a little and uh, they're going to be growing very fast, but uh, we have a challenge in terms of water level and also we can talk about uh, uh, the fertilization of the pond where we have excess feeds are put into the place and also uh, I can show you the excess feeds that have been used into this area. Look at this guys. This is too dangerous to uh, because they cannot consume this kind of uh, the feeds from this place because uh, uh, they only take whatever is uh, uh, floating on top of water because they are top feeders from this side and uh, there are people who are having a, a little congregation here and they are taking place in terms of our responsibility. So, and to this position here, it has to be clean a little and also so as uh, the fish cannot suffocate. I can show you the suffocation. So guys, uh, they cannot even do anything. And uh, you can just remember, guys, that uh, these are the same size uh, with the Yamaros. And but the Yamaros uh, fish are so big right now here. But these ones are due to maybe uh, uh, exposed or uh, put in a small area. So as uh, whenever you want to rear this kind of uh, the tilapia fish and everything like that, uh, you should consider the factor of. Uh, having a large area exposed for them uh, to get moving and everything gonna be moving in a systematic way but today i've uh, chopped here because they called me to have uh, a look on how things are moving into this area but uh, we have this uh, is the condition we have so they might be suffocating here guys look at how they're gonna like and it's sunny day so they're gonna be suffocated they don't even fear something so we're gonna have ammonia attack into this uh, fish pond here but uh, we're gonna transfer them or add more of water into this place uh, so as uh, they cannot uh, get uh, uh, them dying or something like that so uh, gonna be pumping water you wanna pump water oh you think uh, oh he's coming eh? okay gonna be uh, adding some a little bit water here so as uh, they cannot get a uh, miscellaneous if you can just remember guys uh, the first day i stocked them onto this uh, fish pond here but uh, the hotel is not yet uh, opened because they want whenever it's open you know the first impression uh, they want to get the first impression onto this area so as uh, whenever visitors are approaching onto this uh, hotel they're gonna be finding fish uh, just uh, going around because uh, whenever this uh, fish pond is exposed uh, by now it's a good thing Look at it. It's a bluish tile already, and uh, whenever uh, water gets onto the fish pond already, we could have uh, uh, chlorophyll and uh, photosynthesis, uh, and we could have uh, things like phytoplanktons and zooplanktons do occurring or uh, getting or growing from the water surface, which is uh, you can call it the green bloom, or you can call it the green turbidity, or you can call it uh, algae. So those are uh, the things that do. Uh, happen onto the fish pond that's why we have uh, the green color which is a uh, uh, we can have filters already but uh, i'll show you the filters onto the swimming pool there they want to be having filters which are going to be placed onto that big fish pond as uh, to maintain everything onto this area so we're going to be using the pipe to get in water which is uh, a little bit uh, very low guys very low so they're going to be suffocating here so we're going to be doing something correspondent so as to rescue their lives right now here. So I have to chop in so as everything going to be moving in a systematic way. Guys, uh, keep it locked. Everything is possible. It's underscore going to live one-on-one -on -one from Joffa Hotel. Keep it locked. There's a fountain, guys. Yeah, we're gonna be 
having extra water uh, coming in so as uh, we can regulate uh, the temperature of water into this uh, section so as uh, we cannot have a lack of oxygen which is a, a diminishing agent and to whenever we have sunlight you guys uh, you ever know that uh, whenever we have uh, the water ph level uh, we have limiting factors like uh, sunlight uh, we have uh, moisture we have uh, temperature something like that ones guys so whenever we have a high uh, voltage aura we can have uh, a high uh, sunlight which is high temperatures and water we can have a, a low of oxygen concentration so by now we have uh, to add a little bit of water into this uh, fish pond so as uh, we can sustain the fish in water to suffocate uh, a little so today they're gonna be doing this but uh, during the evening session whenever it's a uh, the, the sunlight is just uh, uh, it has gone down we can they can now take off uh, the responsibility of getting the water out and cleaning the pond and uh, they're going to be taking the fish to a, a certain uh, port so as uh, they can be sustained there a little bit so by now everything is possible what is getting so guys uh, everything is possible keep it locked turn the scope into and this is the beginning of this section so as I can uh, make everything move uh, in a system, systematic way ever possible. So by now they're going to be turning back to where the uh, fresh water is coming into. So as uh, because the other one it has a lack of, uh, it's so uh, warm by now. But uh, they have a little bit where now they don't fear anyone because of uh, they have a problem a little. So I'm going to be going in. Them guys, so sometimes they look like uh, some others are lying on others' bodies because of uh, you know, sometimes they could be exhausted, something like that. So they're gonna be turning to where water is coming in through because uh, it's now fresh and oxygen is fresh. So look at how they are turning. Let me show you guys be turning to this point now they are going to where fresh water is coming in because uh, now the oxygen level is raised a bit and to this fish pond so that's how everything going to be moving in a systematic way so this is the uh, whenever you want to know about uh, uh, the oxygen level or you have a challenge with the fish pond uh, that's how now you can just know they are going to where the inlet is uh, coming in so as they can feel now the fresh air coming in and also uh, what is regulated the warmthness and everything so all the fish going to be moving around to where the water is coming into so they're going to be uh, getting a little bit of oxygen from that point and everything going to be moving so guys uh, keep it locked it turns us to and uh, going to be moving to ayamaro site so as a uh, I can bring you more about the hint about the fish ponds going on and to that position well and everything gonna be getting smart guys uh, keep it locked coming back soon Guys, uh, if I can just uh, give the people who uh, are not during that time, I stocked here some fish. I stocked here 300, I can remember 300 uh, brood fish that I stocked here. And there are many guys, uh, look at how they are now moving. So they are coming for oxygen level and everything. Look at that position. So they're gonna, they don't fear anyone because. Uh, it's their survival fitness <laughs> they have to get oxygen look at that one so it won't even water to uh, get onto it so contact body look at that so as uh, it can now feel that vibrant uh, uh, oxygen concentration level going uh, or increased onto this spot so they are now moving helter skelter by now because uh, we have fresh water already inserted here so uh, for the first time people who are who want to get an aquarium or they want to get uh, such kind of a uh, uh, we can talk about a small fish pond like this one here. Uh, we're gonna consider uh, some of the certain uh, 
uh, properties before you can uh, go on with the, the rearing of uh, such kind of tilapia fish or for the people who want to get an aquarium uh, the indoor aquarium is more best because it has filters and it has a uh, uh, oxygen uh, pump and everything like that but this one it depends with the water uh, uh, water only which has the oxygen level and uh, that's why we recommend to have a bigger something that's so big because that uh, the currents of uh, or the waves we can talk about the wind waves that uh, do pass to the water do come with oxygen level so uh, we have uh, water uh, uh, flowing or uh, getting to uh, randomly every Everywhere. so as the oxygen level can be uh, internally uh, be unto the water level so that's how we can uh, have these stuff uh, engaged with so as uh, they can survive so by now you can now see they're now moving maneuvering all around so they are now good everything is possible guys For the first time learners guys this is the best video ever so as they can now know whenever we have low water concentration we have low oxygen concentration and whenever you get water onto that's uh, even for the people who have uh, the fish ponds already whenever you see the fish are congesting where the inlet is you should know that we have a challenge of either yeah, the fish pond has uh, more of a sul uh, hydrogen sulfide than to that fish pond or there is ammonia, something like that. So they're going to be congesting where a fresh air is coming in with the fresh water. So that's what we can call uh, uh, that uh, that fish pond has a little problem. So by uh, evening session, they're going to be uh, taking everything out because we can just, uh, you can never know because the feeds were here, uh, maybe they are made of uh, more of uh, maize uh, products. Because maize products do have uh, uh, ammonia or uh, can talk about hydrogen sulfide. So evening session they might be taking out uh, this water and clean this pot uh, irregularly. After every like five days, four days, they're going to be washing this uh, stuff here. So this is the man responsible for everything. Kyuga, my best friend here. So everything is possible guys, uh, keep it locked. I'm gonna be giving you more hint about uh, the fish pond and this is the best experience of you to learn today and get uh, more of the vibe. This is everything hey bro hey bro it's quite video so guys i want to be ending this video from this uh, section right now here and everything is taking place into this section and this is what we have to embrace as farmers if you want to have the fish and to this site and also we can talk about uh, uh, if you want to get such kind of uh, the produce of fish from where you are you want uh, an entertainment pot or you want uh, something like uh, an aquarium guys uh, you can learn from my videos as i've ju uh, just shown you how things are running from this side guys uh, this is at sanders Gintu. if you are just new to this position i'm the person who is relevant for the, the care and everything about the fish by now they are now jumping and uh, they are now maneuvering because the oxygen level has been increased and now they can move randomly and this is what they want because whenever we have a little amount of water we have low oxygen concentration and to the fish pond so guys i'm going to be updating you more about the fish how they are coming out and how we shall be providing more of the relevant services and maintenance care and tools and equipment used in terms of fish farming guys keep it locked it's underscore gintu keep it coming one-on-one -on -one live from uh, the fish farming or in Jofa Hotel. This is the end. So guys, I'm gonna be moving out from this side so as I can now get to Ayamaro so as I can do everything responsible from that position because it was a little bit of a checkup and everything is moving in a systematic way. Guys, uh, welcome back. <laughs>